<clears throat> Go ahead and put your right hand so it's touching the saddle on the right side. Keep your right hand on the saddle. Yeah. That and, and then when you're turning, you really hold on there so that you don't let your right side come up and over to the left. There you go. And then try to take, take his neck so he puts his neck in the middle of his shoulder. There you go. Good. Open the left quickly so he, he carries his neck in the middle. Keeping your right hand on the saddle and then a quick opening left rein so his neck turns. Exactly. Very good. That's right. So as you approach the turn, you, you think left leg a little further back. Take his neck with you. Take it with you. Exactly. <clears throat> good job. Good. Good job. Never let him carry his neck so that it, it carries away from the alignment of the wither to the pole. Open the left. Use your left leg. So, yeah. Uh, use your left leg. Use it. So he steps under the body from your left leg. And open the left. Yes. Very good. That's right. Good, very good. Open the left, take his neck with you. Don't let his neck get stuck over on the right side. That's right. Good, very good, very good. Excellent. See, now you're sitting really level because you're focusing on keeping the horse level so you're sitting level. Take his neck with you. Don't let the neck get left behind. Take the neck with you. Take it with you. He's not turning his neck. It's lingering to the right. There. Open it. He's still look Exactly. Good job. Very nice. Put your leg under you. Change rein when you're ready. Take his neck with you. Take it with you. Aha. Uh -huh. Super. There. Now you have to think the same way in this direction that you take his neck to the left. So it, it's not that you, you, you don't change it to the new inside rein. You still have to tell, show him to put his neck to the left even in this direction. Because it's not going to change just because you change direction. Good. Neck a little to the left so he doesn't have his head to the right. To help him put his neck to the left. So, good. That's right. Very good. There you go. Fine. Fine. Beautiful. Leg a little more open and then come back a little more with your lower leg. Get your foot more under your hip. Very nice. And when you move the leg back, try not to pull back on the right rein. I know it's hard. You know, because it's so easily done, right? The leg goes back, sure enough, the arm comes with, yeah? Good. Good job. Instead, you just think to put your leg back and, and take his neck to the left. Beautiful. Mm-hmm. Just like that. Just like that. And then change train again. Good. Good. Take his neck with you. Switch your diagonal. Take your, his, no, take his neck with you. Take it with you. Don't let it linger to the right. Yeah, exactly. Don't let the neck linger to the right. Super. Take it with you a little better. It, it's, it doesn't matter if it's just a quarter of an inch. A quarter of an inch is too much. It's got to be level. Good. Take the neck with you. Take it with you. That's right. Come on, come on, come on. He's not coming with. He's not coming. Take it with you. Open that rein until his neck comes over to the left. There. Good. 
Så ja. Super. Open. Good. Take him with you. So it's not enough that you, that you open the rain. You have to make sure you actually take him with you. Take him with you. Yeah, all the way. All the way. Right, left leg back. Take the neck. Come on, come on. Take it with you. Come on. He has to move it over. Yeah, all the time. There you go. That's right. Very nice. And then you can canter and do the same thing in the canter. You take that neck with you. Good job. Put both your legs more back. Keep going. You're almost there. Come on, a little more. A couple of inches. Just a little more. Better. Take the neck with you. Really take it with you because he's lingering. He keeps staying exactly there. Beautiful. Take it with you. Don't let him start drifting to the right and lingering in his turn. He's got to just turn. Yeah, and just turn. And open and turn and open and turn and open and turn and open and open. Take him with you. Use the rein so he follows you. Exactly. There you go. Good. Keep the right hand down. Take him with you. Don't let him not go with you. Right. There you go. And then you trot again. You just level your pelvis and just start trotting with your seat. Like level the pelvis. Yeah, good. And swing. And swing. Exactly. And take him with you right away. Come on. He has to come with you. Take even more. There. That's it. And then you just relax in between. Super. And then show him the way. Right. And then you change rein again. Soon as he initiates the reaction to the turn, you stop turning. Yeah? Good. And then you open the left and make sure his neck stays to the left. That was weird. Can you still hear me? Oh, okay. Are we back in business? <clears throat> All right, then you just change direction, good. Leg back. Good. Then when you're ready, we'll do the right lead canter. Same thing. You, you try to say, okay, straighten out, straighten out with your outside rein. Good. Careful with your left ankle now that you don't brace with your left ankle. That you put your left leg forward. I mean, your left toe facing forward. Sorry. Take his neck to the left. To the left, super. Neck to the left, neck to the left. Aha, uh -huh. good. Open it again, open it again. Don't let him like torque his neck to the right. There you go. And then right leg back a little bit so he steps more under the body with his right hind. <clears throat> there you go. Open the left, exactly. Super nice. There you go. Good, good. Give on that right rein and just open the left. That's okay. Put your leg back before you use it. And then you think like this. You put the leg back and then you use it and then you drop the leg. You put your leg back, you use it, and then you drop the leg right away. Open the left, use the right leg more. Because he, if you feel him wanting to step sideways with the right hand, make a circle now to the right. Look in front of him. Now put your leg for the back. 
So you, you, you show him that he's got to come under the body with the right hind leg. Under the body, under the body, there. So yeah, that's right. And in between using your leg, you make sure the leg exactly drops back down again. Inner leg, get him to respond, yeah. It's okay, keep riding, keep riding. There. Good job. And you open the left, and then right leg again, so he comes all the way level. That's okay. Put your right leg even further back for a couple of strides. Yeah? Even further back. There. That's it. Do that again. Use it now there. Back with it. Yes. And again, because we really get him all the way under. Yeah, and circle again. And inner leg back, even further. You gotta get a, a communication with that hind leg. Inner leg, good. So you feel his body reacting, not his neck. Yeah? So he really, so that your hip opens up and can, and can receive the inner hind leg underneath. Yeah, better. So yeah, yeah, inner leg, that's okay. Now just level your seat and start trotting. Just level your seat and then just good, 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 nice. Nice transition. There you go. Careful now that you don't sit too far to the right. Put your seat a little more to the left and then open up the left, come. And now right leg under, super. Put your right leg a little further back, yeah. Yeah, good, and then just sit a little bit more to the left. Yeah, so yeah, now you change, Rain. Good boy, good boy, so yeah. And now you have to shorten the left rein a little bit so that you can take the neck with you to the left. So it's not enough that you open the rein. If the horse doesn't follow you, that's, then the aid is not, you know, working. Good, open the left. Take him with you. Don't let him linger. Don't let him linger. Don't let him linger. Aha. Take him, take him. He's still going this way. Exactly. There. Good for you. Good job. Take him with you. Don't let him think, you know, to, with his body to the right. Exactly. Good. There you go. Fine. And then you sit up. Leg under you, and then ride a transition to the walk. Stay up, ride him, ride him, ride him, ride him. Don't lean left, though, okay? It was a good transition, except you were leaning left right before it. But it was still a good transition as far as the horse continuing to moving through the body. Okay, now same thing when he's walking. Take him with you to the left. Yeah? There you go. Good. So a yeah, good boy, say. Open the left. Relax your right arm, <clears throat> put your leg a little further back, just lift your leg and then come back. And then the leg can be light on the inside and you can even bring your heel up if you want, that's not a problem. But you cannot uh, shoot your leg forward so that you shut down your hips. That's fine, good boy, good boy. Yeah, and then open your leg and back with your leg. So I have this feeling that the, your big toe is behind the, the back line of the girth. So that the big toe is like in line with the girth. And not the front of the girth, but the, the back part of the girth. Yeah, a little bit more back. So you feel like your leg is connected to his hind legs, yeah? There. So do you feel it? He's really responding there, isn't he? Mm -hmm. That's where the aid, that's where the response is. Right in that spot. You're getting a real no, now he's lingering and staying to the right. Yeah? So yeah. There. And you don't have to move your arms quite that much. You can sit the yeah, beautiful. Now you found the go button, right? Yeah, totally. That's it. And I want you to come down center line. And I want you to leg yield them to the right, please. 
put your leg back, find the nerve endings on, it, on his barrel that are actually connected to the hind leg. You have to open the left a little bit exactly so that the neck doesn't go to the right. Aha, uh -huh. like that. Very good, very good. Open the left, there. So don't pull back on it, you just open. That was pretty good. Now back, leg back again, activate him. Activate the, yeah, super. And then just walk, yeah, turn again. Good. Leg back, I feel that you connect with the hind leg. So you don't, yeah. Open the left rein so that his neck doesn't go to the right. There, sit up. Open your shoulders and sit up. And put your shoulders over your hips. Good job. And then activate him again. Right, good boy. There's the walk, there's the walk. Now you turn left again and then you leg yield to the left. Activate him first. Active, yes. Good, open the left. Open the left, there, good. Line him up, quick, quick aid and then release. Uh, not too much neck bend, not too much neck bend. Activate the engine again. He's slowing, he's losing in propulsion. Yeah, better. Good. And again, turn. And yield again. That's a good energy there. Don't, try not to lose that energy. Come. Open the left. Take him with you. Exactly. Left leg, left leg. Right, left leg. Yeah. Activate him again. Feel that you can activate him while he's yielding. Open the left. Nothing, some double steps. Right there. It's one reaction. Like that. You just don't get it. Come. Good boy. Good boy. Now turn. And I yield without losing that energy. Aha. I don't care if he's trotting. Good. Open. Open the left. The neck is too much bent. Gotta have him straighter. Good boy. So yeah. Good. And walk again. Active. Super transition. Good for you. Now you do Piaf on this long side. Do Piaf on this long side. Doesn't matter, stay up. Once he stops, you use your leg. And you mean it. Yes, exactly. <laughs> right, now you don't have to keep kicking. Now you just sit quiet. And now you take him all the way to the piaffa. Right there. Yeah, sit still. Good, and canter. Fine. Now you put your leg as far back as you can, yeah? And you sit, and you sit, and you sit, and you sit, and you open the left, and that is super there, Evie, super good for you. Don't worry that he's a little bit this way in the neck right now. You just stay and wait, and he will stay shifting. Good job. Now you change direction, open the left, Stay in the counter, canter, stay up and back, up and back, up and back, same canter, open the left. Try not to look to the left, remember? You're supposed to, yeah. Careful, you're collapsing to the left with your upper body, leg back. Careful, yeah, good, open the left, stay back, stay back. Now release on the right rein. Start with opening the left rein. Exactly. Keeping your body softly turned to the, to the right. Upper body to the right. Upper body to the right. You're leaning to the left. Good. 
There. Give more on the right right now. And just ask him to bend. So, yeah. There. A little more until he completely canters without his neck. All the way. Just sit and wait. Good job. Good job. And then chain train. Good. Put your hands forward. Sit up and back. Sit up and back. Sit up and back. Put your hands forward. Come. Now right leg back. And now let me see a reaction to that leg aid on the long side. Don't kick him with your left leg. Just kick him with your right leg. With it further back until he steps under the body. It's not good enough. That's not good enough. He's not stepping under the body. He's stepping to the side of the body. So he has to step under the body. Yeah? It's okay. Try not to tip forward when he blows his nose. Good. 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 Now stay up and start thinking short, quick, short, quick, short, quick, short, quick, short, quick, short, quick into a transition to the trot. Short, quick, short, quick, short, quick, short, quick. Good. Not slower. Okay? There you saved it really well. You saved that reaction really well. But it's important that you can feel a difference between him getting quicker and shorter and not slower and shorter, yeah? You know what I mean? Good boy. Give him a little break. Good job. But today, you are really getting him to come with you. You know, that's a huge piece, huh? But you got to think about it more often, you know, because when you're asking it, you're doing it. You're getting a reaction. So you just have to try to be a little bit more consistent. Don't forget about it because it's a very important piece. You know, if the horse keeps ca carrying himself all the time with the neck off to one side, right? His spine is never straight, you know? And then he can't come through all the way with this energy and he'll never straighten his body all the way, you know? So now let's encourage him to walk a little more. Just find the, the, the go button. There it is. There is the go button. Very good. That's right. Good. And I just do a right turn. Give the eight stop turning. Exactly. And I do a left turn. Open the left, stop turning. Exactly. Turn again. Stop turning. Exactly. Leg back so that you don't lose the energy. Open the left without leaning left with your upper body. Yeah. Put his neck to the left, to the left, to the left. Yes. To the left. Right. Good. There you go. Good job. Then you go ahead. Good. That's right. Open the left, open the left. Oh, he's swinging his head to the right too much in his neck. Open the left, open the left. Take him with you. There. Good. Then you gather the reins and then you do double steps again. But try to go all the way to the piaffa. Yeah, good. So after he backs up, Wait, wait, now use your leg. But not a slow leg, a quick leg. Wait, good, now quick leg. First create that he's true, that's okay. Don't do anything when he's backing up because then you're sustaining the backing up, good. Now when you ask, now left leg back, left leg back. <coughs> Sit up, don't do anything when he's backing up, wait for him to stop. Try not to disengage your shoulder blades. Stay there. Good. Now you say go. But you have to, you found the go button earlier. Give it there. That's okay. Stay up. Don't disengage your shoulder blades. Put your leg to the go button. Yeah, that's okay. Good. Stay up. Stay up. Good. Stay up and up. And I ask him to go. He has to go. He has to do it. Right. 
Shorten your left, reins too long. Sit still with your seat. Open the left rein a little bit. Open the left, good, good, good. Sit still. Left leg back. Good job. That's a good, yeah, that's good, so stay up. Up, left leg, left leg, don't let, don't let him stop. Don't ever let the horse do the stopping. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Good, open your left rein. Open your left rein. Take his neck with you. Good, go back to the walk again. Find the, don't stop him, don't stop him, exactly. Now put your leg much further back, your left leg. Good, good, and now you ask. Hind legs first, left rein, open it. Now, it, now you're letting him stop. Open the left. It's better if you don't stop all the way, huh? Because the moment you stop all the way, you have to start all the way back again, you know, to get him in front of your leg, yeah? Yeah? Right. Open the left. Open the left. Take him back to the walk. Do not stop. Good. Good. Now double steps. Not trotting. Double steps. Leg for the back so you have the true go button in the horse. Yeah, hand stays down and quiet. There. Sit still. Bring him back, bring him back without stopping him, without stopping him. Put your hands down, Evie, and shorten your reins. <clears throat> yeah, left leg, left leg, left leg. So, and bring him back more, bring him back more, bring him back, bring him back, bring him back. But keep the hind legs moving. Left leg, you gotta get him now. One time. So get him off the left. Yeah? So, yeah. Yeah, you gotta get him level. You gotta get him level. Keep your hand down. Keep your hand there. Super. Now listen to me. On this long side, in that trot step, you're gonna do shoulder. You're leaning left, Evie. You're leaning left. You're gonna do shoulder in now. In that trot step, exactly, exactly, good job. That's a real shoulder in, good job. Very nice, yeah? <clears throat> good job, you're gonna do that again. Stay up and open, up and open, open the left, left leg for the back, right. Exactly, and then shoulder in. Good, without leaning left, good job. Make a half circle and reverse. Open the left, take his neck with you. Take it with you, take it with you as to turn. So yeah, that's right. Good job, put your hand down. Now more on the spot. Sit, 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 don't brace, don't brace. Quick leg, sit. Don't pull, just sit and use your leg. Yes. Just sit and release and use your leg. Sit, release and use your leg. Sit, release and use your leg. There you go. Now, you, did you feel like you just shifted him? Totally, right? Shoulder in. A little more angle. Ah, super, super, super. Good for you. Well done. Now you do the same thing, you sit up, you activate, you release. You sit up, you activate, release, you shift him. Just like you did over here. Yeah, yeah, sit, release, and quick. Sit, release, quick. Sit, release, quick. Super, shoulder in. There. Look in front of him, yeah? There you go. Beautiful, you're doing great. And walk, quick, 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 quick. Better, pet him. Good job. Here, when you came here, right, and he wanted to start shifting, the way you rode right here, perfect. Perfect. Yeah, you felt it? Yeah, yeah. So I think, I'm thinking too much about pulling when I just need to be quick. Yeah. And then, you know, then what you do is you sit up, you release, pop, pop. 
And then you could feel how instead of him going ee, 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 like this, he just went Brrr, and then he shifted right back. Yeah. And, that, and then when you have that, you can school whatever exercise you want in that feeling. Yeah. Then you lost him a little bit again there, and then you got it back again, you know? So that was really a big piece of the puzzle right there. Very, very nice. Because now you, you came to a place where you can actually do it while you're in motion. You, you right? Yeah. And it's to be able to do it while you're, you know, you're still in the gate that you're riding. So now you're learning to make transitions within the gate. You know what I mean? To change, right? Yeah. And that's harder than anything else. To be able to, to make, ride that differentiation, you know, within the stride. That's what riding is all about. You can actually break it down to two very easy components. Riding is about the ability to control the step length and the speed, yeah? If you really think about it, yeah, that's really all we're doing. Controlling the step length and the speed. But you know, it takes, it sounds simple when we just break it down to those two components. <laughs> but it's really what it's all about. You know what a friend of mine did? Uh, she was on, the, they have a TV program in Sweden with Pony Kids. And she was one of the trainers, whatever. You know what she did? It was awesome. So they had like a field of maybe 15 kids, right? And they had to start at point A to point B. And it was about, the race was about who came last in Canter. So it was not who got there first, it was who got there last, you know? And I thought that was so awesome. Because that's what it's all about, the controlling of, of the stride length and the speed. So she, so even if they obviously didn't do it very sophisticated, yeah. you know what I mean? But by getting the kids to do that, you're really setting them up for the, for the total understanding of what it's all about. And I thought it was awesome. And you should have seen the horses, because you know, the horses wanted to go, right? And the kids are like, no, 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 like, stay here. But it, it taught them a lot. Good. Okay, so now we go back again. Now really think now like this, like what I said to you yesterday. You know how to get them to do the piaf without doing the trot first. Now do that. <coughs> Put your leg, good. Don't back off, don't back off. Yeah, don't do anything when he's doing that and don't disengage your arms, don't disengage, exactly. That's right, you just stay there. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. That's not gonna work for you. Good, now leg back, find the go button. Yeah, that's okay, sit, sit, sit. Make sure your seat bones don't point back. Yeah, good, and then we go again. First you just go forward, walk normal. You sit, you relax your arms, you put your leg for the back. Yeah, 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 open the, yeah, come, more on the spot. Again, you sit, you release, you use your leg. You sit, you release, you use your leg. Put it more on the spot. Sit, release, use your leg. Sit, release, use your leg. Beautiful. Sit, release, yeah, but I love it, I love it. Now canter. Change nothing, change nothing. Sit, release, use your leg. Sit, release, use your leg. Exactly. I don't care if his neck is going a little up and down like that, just let it. Because you see where his pole is? It's way up there, huh? But he's not up and out, yeah? Good, and up and sit, good. Sit, release, use your leg. Sit, release, beautiful. Now your horse is straight. Now he's straight. Now he's under. Sit, release, use your leg. Don't let the reins get longer and longer because then you're gonna lose the engagement. Sit, release, use your leg. Sit, release, use your leg. Good. Now try to get him quicker. So you can do a transition down. Quicker, 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 quicker. Activate those hind legs. And quick, 
quicker, quicker and shorter, quicker and shorter, quicker and shorter, quicker and shorter. No, don't let him get lateral. Quicker and shorter, quicker and shorter, quicker and shorter. Yeah? Yeah? Quicker and shorter, don't let him fall. But yes, well done. Now sit, release leg. Shift him again. You can do it. Put your leg a little, yes ma'am. Super. Now more quick. But sit first, sit, release. If you don't release, you're gonna, be, you, you're gonna brace with your thighs. There, you just released, did you feel it? You totally let go, right? Where did you let go the most, just because I need to know? Oh, in the reins, that was enough? Yeah. That released this right away? Okay, perfect. Chain train. Active. Leg back. I gotta see your leg back. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Do it, do it, do it. Good. Sit, release leg. Sit, release leg. Sit, release leg. Yes, exactly. Look at that. He's moving off your left leg now. Beautiful. Sit, release leg. Come. Now get a reaction. No leaning left now. There you go. Sit, release leg. Don't pull. You're leaning left, Davy. Come on, you gotta figure it out. Yeah, come on, up to the right, over to the right, over to the right. There. That's why you had such a beautiful turn here earlier because you were level. Good. Open the left. Sit, release leg. Now get a better reaction to the go button. Put the leg back. Yeah, get it again. Come. There. Super. Good boy. Don't do anything to the neck. Just ride. Just sit. There you go. See, now you're sitting. Good job. There it is. There it is. You got it. You got it. You got it. Beautiful. Now you're good job. Now you just need to lower your hand down and change nothing. And then you got it. Then you got the whole piece. Everything is there. Everything is there now. That's right. Change nothing. Change nothing. That's fine, you're doing super. You're doing super. Careful with your upper body, you're leaning. Upper body to the right, Davy. to the right, to the right. Come on, come on. More. Upper body that way, neck to this way. Yes, exactly, there we go. That's it. You sit, release, and your leg. Let, let me see a good reaction to the leg again. But not when you're holding the rein. When you, yes, exactly. That's right. Good job. Now you canter, change nothing. You just sit up and you just canter. Super, sit up and give. And leg. Sit, release, and leg. And sit, release, and leg. Exactly, sit, release, and leg. Good job, sit, release, and leg. Upper body to the right. Don't let the rain, you're leaning. Upper body to the right, yes. There you go. Good job. Now you put both your hands down, really down. You make a circle left 20 meters. And you sit up and you canter now. Look in front of him. Don't let your left leg drop down. Good, look in front of him. You're looking in, look in between his ears. Take his neck with you. <clears throat> Lower the right hand. Sit a little more to the left with your seat and canter. Look in front of him, you're looking in. Lower the right hand. Canter, canter, canter from your inner leg. There you go. Super. Now just level your seat and start trotting. Just sit now and let him take. Now I'll come. There. Fix your legs. Fix your legs. Put your hand down. Sit, give leg. Come, 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 come. Now trot, 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 trot. Oh, yeah. Chain train, upper body to the right, to the right. Take his neck to the left. Sit, 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 sit. Leg under you. Come on, we're losing energy. There, there. Hand down, give. Good. No, not allowed to slack off. Not allowed to slack off. We've got to keep going. Come, 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 come. Drop your shoulders. Drop your shoulder blades into his hind legs. Feel them, feel them, feel them. There, there. Good, good. Super, super. Leg back, leg back, super there. Come, come, sit, 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 sit. Good job. 
Sit, Gib, sit, Gib. Oh, come on, he's slacking off. If you don't take care of it now, you're going to have to do too much repair work. There, good job. And walk, just give, give right in with you, take him with you, take him with you, take him with you, take him with you. And that is super. Good job. That was really good. Yeah? That's awesome. Good, see, now he's walking. You feel it? Yeah, now you just put your leg back and he's gonna walk. He's gonna listen to you now. He's gonna go. Right. Open both your legs, legs further back, and find the go button. Say, come on, boy. There, you felt it? Super. Right. That, good boy. Tell him, good boy. Tell him, good boy. That's perfect. Ex nah. Now, don't let him find your hands. Just put your hand down. Good, and now you trot again. Just keep your hands down now. Just keep them down and quiet. And sit up and back, up and back, up and back. Good job. There. And now you train your leg coming back. Make a half circle. He's absolutely dead straight there. Perfect. Stay up, 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 up. Come. Find the go button again. Find it. Find the place where he responds to your leg. Really find it, up and back, up and back, let go. Find the go button, you didn't find it. There, almost. There, you got it, you got it. That's right. Drop those shoulders down. Find the go button again, come on, you gotta get it. There, good. Super. Super nice. Don't lose your leg position when you're turning. Because if you do that, you lose the forward. Change rein, take his neck with you. No leaning, no leaning. Take him with you instead. There you go. Good job. Super nice. Good, if he fix your right stirrup. You, you lost your location of your leg. That's why you're losing forward energy. Because your hips are starting to shut them down. There you go. That's right, aha, super. That's right, now canter, just go click, click, and just go. Good job, leg back, leg back, come on. Beautiful, beautiful. Let your arms down, let your arms down. Open your shoulders, exactly. Leg stays beautifully like that, beautiful with your leg there. Don't let it slip when you're turning, don't let it slip. Good job, now a little more go. You can do it easily, aha, like so. That's right. Open, the, open, yes. Leg slip forward again, then you're gonna lose it. That's okay. And trot again. You just level your pelvis and let him trot. Good, come, 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 let him trot. Exactly. Fix your foot and then fix the leg position. Change rein. Fix your foot and fix your leg position. Good boy. Good boy. Fix your left leg. Hurry up. Hurry up. Do not let yourself come to that turn now with your left leg forward. You come to that turn with your left leg under you. Under you, under you. That's not good enough. It's not good enough. It's got to become further under you. And then, you, then the horse will stay in the same trot. Take the neck with you so he's straight coming out of the... Yeah, that's okay, it doesn't matter. Yeah, do it again, because he's on his way over here again. Exactly. There, turn, turn. Don't wait for the fence. Right. Good job. And you just let your pelvis... Beautiful, look at that. Just relax your back now. And let him just take you. And then left back, leg back again. Left leg back, take the neck with you, take the neck with you, take the neck with you. Yeah, but lower your right hand. You're not allowed to lift your right hand. And you're not allowed to collapse. Take him with you, take him with you. Exactly. Good job. And then you can't, they just go click, click. Beautiful. Find the go button. It's not about strength, it's about finding the place where he responds. Take him with you, he's not going with you. Exactly, take him again, because he's on his way to the right. There you go. That's right, open up the left, take him with you. You show him the way. You show him where his neck needs to be. Good job. You're sitting beautiful there, take him with you. 
Take him with you. Take him. Come on, he's lingering. He's not following you. There you go. That's right. Good job. Now you just open up and, yeah, that's fine. Good, take him with you. He's lingering to the right again. Take him with you more. Without falling, come on, he's got to turn when you ask him. So, yeah. There. Good job, pet him. Let him all the way out. Now put the whip in your right hand. Now you tap him on the front. But take the neck with you first. Good, don't ride so with your arms. Open and drop. Good boy, now tap his front legs out. Good boy. Good boy, tap him again. There, super nice. Good boy, pet him. Say good boy, sit up again. Chain train. Without lead, yeah, I love it, I love it. Super, put the whip in your other hand. Tap his left front. Keep the neck in the middle of his, of his body. Super, legs under you, legs under you. Watch his neck, open the left, not the right. Tap the left shoulder. Super, there you go. Next long side, I want you to think even bigger trot. Stay up and back, leg under you, that's a super trot. Come, send him out, good boy. Hands down, open the left, not the right. Open the left, not the right, exactly. Do the out again, really out, sit up, up. Yeah, keep the, you crotch underneath the wither. Your shoulder blades connected to his hind legs. Keep your shoulder blades connected to use a little bit the right, beautiful. Excellent. That's right. Super. Good boy. And sit up, sit down, do not walk. Just sit with your leg back. Ah, uh -uh, exactly. Papa, exactly. And then you think, like you're gonna go to Piaffa now. Just shorten your reins a little bit. And think quick, 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 quick. Good boy. Aha. Uh -huh. Excellent. Yeah, but that was super transition. That was a super transition. Yeah, yeah. Another good one. Good for you. Very good. Excellent. Very nice. I felt you got a very big piece today. Right over there earlier. <laughs> yeah? That was super nice. Good job. Good boy. Very nice. So remember now, if you feel like you have to give a strong leg, yeah. you're just giving the leg aid in the wrong place. Okay. Yeah? Because you found it many times. Yeah, yeah. When the leg comes in the proper place, first of all, it is the proper place on his body where the nerve endings communicate to the hind leg. Yeah. That's one. But not only that, it is also that when your leg is in the proper position, it opens your hips, which is, was very, very evident because you set a very forward active trot. And you set it. Yeah, I don't have to do that. Right? <laughs> I mean, you just set with it. Yeah. You see what I mean? And it, that was a big energetic step that you set. Yeah? It's very forward. It was very big. You know what I mean? Like yeah. in, in relation to where you were, right? And I never once felt that you were not sitting with them. Do you agree? Yep. Yep. It was super nice. No, that was excellent. And it was great because I wasn't sure what you released over there. And because you see, so what happens is this, right? When you're holding here, you get the sense that you're being pulled. And that's when you brace here so that you don't get pulled all the way. So, yeah, but obviously it was all you needed was to let go of the rein and that released this automatically because you were no longer being pulled forward. So you didn't have to brace against it. Yeah. Yeah, I think that was a big... Oh, it was beautiful. You did great. Absolutely.